Good morning, boys and girls. Um, today I just wanted to share something with you that um, God reminded me of this week. And that is that there is a time for everything that happens in this world. And that means that there is a time for COVID-19 and there's going to be a time where it's going to be over and we're going to be able to go back to doing all the things we were doing before this hit. And with that in mind, there's a very well-known passage of scripture that I want to read to you. And it's from Ecclesiastes 3 verses 1 to 8. And it says this, a time for everything. For everything there is a season, a time for every activity under heaven, a time to be born and a time to die, a time to plant and a time to harvest, a time to kill and a time to heal, a time to tear down and a time to build up, a time to cry and a time to laugh, a time to grieve and a time to dance, a time to scatter stones and a time to gather stones, a time to embrace and a time to turn away, a time to search and a time to quit searching, a time to keep and a time to throw away, a time to tear and a time to mend, a time to be quiet and a time to speak, a time to love and a time to hate, a time for war and a time for peace. And I was so reminded this week that this isn't going to last. This COVID-19, it's not going to last. It's a season. It's There's going to be a time for it. And then there's going to be a time where we can go back to seeing our friends and family, playing with our friends, not having to keep our distance, not having to wear masks. But right now in this season, I think something that God's reminded me of and something that I think um, he wants us to think about while we're going through this is that we have so much that we can be thankful for. We have so much to be grateful for. Um, our friends, our family, uh, our houses, our food, our toys. And yes, boys and girls, we can be thankful for toys too. I just, I think God wants to remind us and wants us to think about all the things we have to be grateful for because this isn't going to last forever. And so I have a challenge for every single one of you and ask mom and dad to help you if you really come stuck and you can't think of anything. But I want to ask you and challenge you guys, try to find something, one thing every day that you are thankful for this week and and thank god for it and even even if it's that favorite toy that that toy you love playing with or that teddy bear you just love snuggling with that's something you can be grateful for if it's your teachers thank god for your teachers if it's your mom and dad thank god for your mom and dad i just want you to remember that this isn't going to last forever and there's so much still that we have to be happy about. There's so many things we have to be grateful for. And so that's my challenge to you. Try and find one thing every day that you are thankful for. Um, and remember, this isn't going to last forever. And one day, we're going to be able to hug and go to a birthday party and have some fun and without worrying anymore. Um, but until that happens, let's just remember that we've lots to be thankful for. And I think we're going to have more to be thankful for when this is over. We're going to be able to look back and say, you know what? God brought me through Corona and he brought me through COVID-19. And I think that's going to be so wonderful to look back and see all that God has done for us. I want to pray for us. Dear Jesus, I just want to thank you so much for every boy and girl listening to this video and every mom and dad. And help us to remember, and thank you for reminding us, that this season is not going to last forever. It is going to end. And Father, I just pray that when it does, we will be able to look back and see all the wonderful things you've done for us. And we'll be able to say thank you, Lord, for bringing us through. And I just pray, Father, that as we go into this week, you'll help every boy and girl to find at least one thing a day that they're grateful for. And just that you'll help to remind us all that this too shall pass. Help us to be thankful for what you have done. 
And I pray that you'll help us to be thankful for what you are going to do. We love you, Father, and we pray this in your name. Amen.